Hello and welcome to jkkmobile.com As you can see I have a EPC 901 here and the reason for that is that I have a new prototype adapter for it so as you may remember uh, the first units of uh, 901 let's take the bottom hatch away had a ZIV connector over here so you could uh, you could uh, install hard drive on those uh, but now the currently shipping versions don't have it so getting it working is a major job you have to fully open the device find the adapter uh, find the uh, connector and solder it there and so on so that's not not a fun job so what I have now here let's take this this secondary SSD away, so this is the uh, bigger but slower SSD inside the 901. If you take that away, you can actually actually put this kind of adapter to it. Where is the screw? There. If you put this adapter here, you can now have the connector and the cable for the hard drive and changing that would be simple as this uh, it's not exactly as simple as actually you you also need a, need a new cover for it because uh, the, the adapter now brings the hard drive a bit up and uh, and uh, having that new new uh, new housing or, or, or hatch for it you can get everything working nicely so really easy easy job you just unscrew the, the SSD put the adapter in put the cable to the to the uh, hard drive this adapter comes with the cable and that's it you can use hard drive on 901 uh, what what uh, brought me to this idea uh, was actually Asus themselves. I have here Asus uh, own adapter from uh, uh, EPC 900 uh, hard drive version, which is sold only in China currently. Uh, but this adapter is not good for this use, as I will show you, as the connector is over there. So putting a hard drive there. Uh, would uh, raise the hard drive too much so it doesn't fit inside uh, even if you cut away parts here it doesn't fit so so the the uh, prototype I have over here is perfect fit you can you can use either um, either five millimeter or eight millimeter bigger drives so really high uh, high uh, uh, capacity storage is so I will post uh, the, the um, prices and so on as soon as possible. Right now I only have this prototype and uh, I've been testing it, works perfectly. And uh, after that you can easily have as much, almost as much storage you, you, you want on the 901. So what about the 900 series? I have a 900A here, which comes with a bit slow SSD. Uh, you can, of course, upgrade it, uh, its SSD for the better one. But if you want uh, want a hard drive on it, you can, of course, use this adapter too. The problem here is that uh, when you put the adapter in, as you can see, there is not much room so normal 1.8 inch hard drive doesn't fit so you would have to cut away a lot of plastic uh, plastic from it to make it make it uh, work there and you will also need need to cut cut a hole on the hatch or something but the good news is that uh, there will be there will be a, a custom made hatch for that too so you can you can then have a, have a small hard drives or or, or 1.8 inch really fast SSDs on uh, any versions of, of the EPC 900.
So I think this is a really good good news for VPC users, especially if you if you want something really fast and furious for the 901, it's a it's a good way to go. And again, having tons of storage with a with a nice price, it's it's a nice thing. So I will be reporting more soon. Uh, I think uh, it should be available in in next few weeks, uh, uh, but it might be even sooner. So keep keep your eyes up. I will uh, post information about this immediately when I have more. Thank you. Bye.